days ago, a good friend of mine sent me an interesting article huh? on the mindset list. She thought it would be good for me to read and maybe even incorporate into some of my speeches. You see, the mindset list has been created by a group of college professors. This mindset list explores the collective experiences of the incoming freshman class. And the reason that they did this was they wanted the professors Think about college professors. They're so into their topic, right? They're so into their chemistry, their world history, and their languages that they many times forget about the students. And so what this whole idea is, is to give each professor a list of these experiences that this incoming class shares so that they can become more human with them. So what I thought I would do is take a moment and share with you the mindset list for the incoming freshmen who are graduating in the class of 2022. And it's interesting because maybe in your freshman class, if you are in this group, you might be with Madonna's son, Rocco. Yeah, he's gonna be a freshman this year. Or you might be with Will Smith's daughter, Willow, yeah. Because these are all incoming freshmen. So what I thought I would do is share with you a few of the things, just a few, there's 50 on the mindset list for this entering class who will be graduating in 2022. Number one, uh, this is the first class that um, outer space has never been without human habitation, yeah. Sent someone to the moon. This is the group, this class has always used the Wikipedia. They don't go to the library very often. I have to read this one because it's kind of interesting. People loudly talking to themselves in public. Hello! It's normal, right? How many times I'm at the airport and I hear people talking to themselves all the time, but uh, we used to put them in the... Uh... Right through here. How about this one? Every year they're used to seeing a special on the O.J. Simpson trial. I would never, ever wear size 12 Bruno Molly shoes. Yeah, how about that? And they haven't been to a bank ever. They have no reason to go to a bank because they just take the picture, right? And here's my favorite one. Robert Downey Jr. has always been sober and he's always been the Iron Man. Just to give you a reference, here are a couple of the things that were on the mindset list for kids who were entering college in 1998 and graduating in 2002. Number one, The Tonight Show always had Jay Leno as the host. And number two, they never played Pac-Man or Pog. So if you want more information on the mindset list, just email me at karen at karenmccullough.com. I hope you enjoyed this lesson from the road.